CrossFit is a rigorous form of fitness training that is gaining popularity worldwide. Of course, as a CrossFit fan, you need the best fitness tracker for CrossFit. Here we'll look at some of the best fitness trackers for CrossFit on the market. If you want to see the price and find out more information about these products, you can check out the links in the description below. And make sure you like the video, subscribe our channel, and hit the bell icon for future updates. Without further ado, let's get started with the list. Starting our list with number 5, we have the Polar Vantage V. The Polar Vantage V makes a great all-around multisport watch, but it's not the best option for runners, who are better off with the Forerunner 935 or 935 XD. Like the Forerunner models, the Vantage V has heart rate and VO2 sensors built in, and the VO2 sensor is one of the most accurate we've seen in a GPS watch. The VO2 sensor measures your oxygen consumption during activity. Polar software balances your metabolic fitness level, giving you an unbiased view of your body's ability to convert fuel into energy. The watch also tracks running power, calculated based on your running cadence, stride length, and other factors. You could adjust the power zone and training load manually, and Polar software automatically adapts the zones and training load. Some runners may be put off by the watch's monochrome display and relatively bulky size, but these features make it better suited to multisport users. For swim training, the Vantage V has waterproof capabilities down to a depth of 50 meters, and you can track your lap count, pace, stroke count, stroke rate, and distance. The Vantage V also works as a standalone GPS watch, using GPS and mapping data to track running, walking, cycling, swimming, skiing, and more. At number 4, Samsung Galaxy Watch. The Samsung Galaxy Watch Active builds on all the great features of the Galaxy Watch and adds many new features. It has a built-in GPS, which tracks your run without you even needing to think about it, and the GPS works indoors and out, so the watch counts your steps even if you were to wander into an alley with nothing but concrete between you and Google Street View. It's compatible with Android, including iPhones and iOS devices, and it has NFC, so you can use the Galaxy Watch Active as your wireless payment system. Samsung Pay and Apple Pay are both supported, but Android Pay and PayPal aren't. The watch also has a built-in LTD connection to check your messages and the news or stream your favorite music from the watch itself. The Galaxy Watch Active is also available in the same black model we tested, as well as olive green, dark blue, and rose gold, all with dark, legible faces. The watch is also thinner than our current pick for the best budget smartwatch, the Pebble Time 2, and it feels just as light, though it's a tad thicker due to its full-size round face. The battery lasts several days on a single charge, and Samsung says you can expect 10 days from a full charge, though we typically get about 6 days. Number 3. We have the Fitbit Versa Lite. The Fitbit Versa Lite is a fitness tracker with a color touchscreen and built-in GPS. It's Fitbit's most economical device and the least expensive GPS-enabled exercise tracker on the market. Most of its features are similar to its more expensive Fitbit Ionic and Fitbit Blaze siblings. The Versa Lite is waterproof to 50 meters, so you can swim with it. Its battery life is among the best of any Fitbit device we've tested, lasting four days on a single charge with regular use. Its touchscreen is less responsive than Fitbit devices with more expensive displays, but it's good enough for navigating the fitness tracking menus. The Versa Lite tracks steps, distance, calories, heart rate, floors, climbed, active minutes, and intensity minutes during workouts. It automatically tracks select sports, including swimming, biking, and running. For tracking sleep, there is automatic sleep stage tracking, as well as the ability to track sleep manually. It has several new cool features, including daily reminders to move, a dashboard showing your stats, and automatic Fitbit reminders, which ping you at the end of sedentary periods to tell you to get up and move. The Versa Lite is also a convenient smartwatch that automatically tracks basic phone notifications, including phone calls, texts, calendar alerts, and app alerts. It has a battery life that lasts two days and charges in an hour. At number 2, Apple Watch Series 5. The Apple Watch Series 5 is a perfect smartwatch. It's much improved over the Series 4 model, and it's worth considering if you value the fitness and health features. The Series 5 is water-resistant. That's a feature you will probably never use unless you live in the wilderness. But it's nice to know that you can use it. The display is nearly 30% larger than before, which makes a big difference in watching videos. The watch is also finely swim-proof. 
The built-in heart rate sensor is more accurate than the Series 4, but isn't as handy for tracking workouts as an external chest strap. The ECG app helps check whether your heartbeat matches your beats per minute, but we found it less helpful in preventing irregular beats. These features aside, the Series 5 provides many valuable health and fitness features. The always-on display makes the watch comfortable to read, and the battery life is much improved, lasting more than 5 hours after a full charge and 37 hours on standby. The watch also supports automatic workout detection, which means you forget it's even there. It knows when it's running and will pause your watch at the end of your run or ride. Resume it when you pick up the watch, and it will track whatever workout you do next. And finally, the number one of our list, Garmin Fenix 6 Sapphire. This Garmin smartwatch is pricey, but it's a solid choice for hikers, skiers, and mountain bikers who want GPS, music, and more with advanced features to help them train. The Fenix 6 Sapphire also compares favorably to our former top pick, the Garmin Fenix 5 Plus, and you'll find many of our other top pick vests here too. The Fenix 6 Sapphire has a slightly larger screen, 1.3 inches versus 1.2 inches, and a larger battery, 50 milliampere versus 40 milliampere. It also has an accelerometer, gyroscope, and barometric altimeter that can make it worthwhile for runners and climbers. Battery life is also better. With the ability to get two days in GPS mode and up to 10 hours in watch mode, compared to the Fenix 5 Plus, which can go a day in GPS mode and only about five hours in watch mode. The most significant difference between the Fenix 6 and the previous model is that the new model has a sapphire crystal, making it more durable and less prone to scratches. For outdoor performers, the Fenix 6 Sapphire also has downloadable maps for more than 2,000 ski resorts worldwide meaning you can take your watch on the slopes. The watch is compatible with the Garmin Pay contactless payment service, but not all countries support this feature, and not all payment networks are compatible, and can also be used with a music streaming service. As always, you will find all the links of these products in the description below. Thanks for watching this video. If you found this video helpful, then like and share this video. Also, don't forget to subscribe our channel for more amazing videos like this.